you're changing an environment. And it's a huge responsibility. Is only going to be meant for Washington Middle School. And it's going to be a reflection of the community. I want us to look at the plants that have existed in this area that are like sprouting up through the cracks in the sidewalks. We call them weeds, but they're plants. And they have a resilience of kind of staying within this region, despite houses being built, despite sidewalks being kind of plowed over them. Um, and that's kind of the way that I see with the people of this community. I, as an artist, I'm a painter, I'm a drawer, I'm an illustrator, and I'm a muralist. And I'm a teacher. Maclovia Zamora, she is a very old herbalist. Um, she knows all about the medicinal properties of plants. This is like a whole pharmacy right in front of us. People used to know all of these properties before they could readily go out and buy a pill, okay? So we happened upon um working classroom. So the mission of working classroom is to work with communities to transform their communities through art. So every artwork we do has a theme that inspires people to contribute to society. The community just pitched in. It, it just really, it makes me proud to live in this community, seeing how everybody came together for this thing. It's, it's a really fantastic thing. It's also a symbol for the transformation and growth that is happening within the school. Projecting is it's always an amazing process because you kind of get this glimpse for just a moment of what it's actually going to look like. En nuestro muro está adentro de nuestra escuela y como los niños um, están acostumbrados a ver otra cosa y al ver algo nuevo se van a emocionar y van a querer admirarlo más de cerca. The children that are in the mural, the picture of them, they're the new generation is us and the old plants that have been here from for a very very long time, they represent the old people that have stuck through and lived through all the harsh times. The plants, it's mostly the plants that we see here in New Mexico growing like in the cracks, like in the street. Well, it just shows that we've been here for a really long time. And that like, even though we struggle to like find a way to survive, like we're still here. We're still growing in between the cracks. Which is really takes a lot of strength to be like pushing out concrete and butterflies that fly a really long way every year. They're like intelligent creatures. That, that's why we picked them. They are really like frail, but in big groups, they can change a lot. I guess everyone who worked on this mural is strong, like the butterflies. I mean, this mural has been more hard labor than painting, so. I think the mural itself, the painting, is really representative of Washington and this community because it's called resilience because this community has been so resilient to everything that's come around it and the school. Um, it means that everybody kind of stayed here no matter like what it's been through and the city's growing and everybody has still stayed here no matter that there's still a city around them, the neighborhood is still here. You should really become a part of your community and start doing things like this. It'll really help with a lot of things. Mm -hmm.